With respect to North Korea, uh, this is a problem, a nuclear North Korea for China as well. Is President Xi basically benefiting from the belligerent talk from President Trump because he gets to play a good cop to President Trump's bad cop? Basically, uh, China will do anything in its own national interest, just as the United States will in any other country. China um, um, wants to use North Korea, frankly, for its own benefit. That is to keep the United States at bay. Um, I, I, I frankly am quite concerned that uh, we're not going to make much headway with China. I think that President um, Xi, in many respects, uh, played President uh, Trump at Mar-a-Lago. Um, and they, the Chinese are very experienced at this. They know how to play American presidents. Um, in past summits I've attended with, say, Xi and Obama, they've been very different. Um, each side basically stated its, its point of view. But this time around, I think that uh, President uh, Trump has realized that um, this guy, President Xi, is a lot tougher character, is a lot more difficult to deal with than he realized. And we Americans, to solve the North Korean problem, I think, have to also parallel, maybe in first, come up with a very strong basic strategy on how we handle China generally, because that's going to go a long way in determining how we deal with, uh, with North Korea. Well, let's talk for a moment about how we handle China generally, because President Xi has been very outspoken on the subject of free trade. In fact, he came out just today, and I'm going to quote here what he said, major developed countries have significantly um, backtracked positions on trade, climate change, and other issues. An implicit slap really back at the United States saying Brazil, Russia, India, and China need to speak in one voice to steer the world economy in the right direction. So President Xi is really calling out implicitly President Trump here, favoring free trade. Is there an opportunity here to actually call President Xi's bluff and say, do you really believe in free trade? Let's take a look at some of your trade patterns. Well, I, I think there is. I mean, frankly, um, it's not the pat, uh, pot calling the kettle black. It's, it's worse than that. China is a very protectionist country, very protectionist. Um, and frankly, I think we Americans have let, have let China get away with a lot, especially in, in the high-tech industry. So when you hear President Xi make statements like that, boy, I really roll my eye, eyeball because um, they're, 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 um, they're very protectionist. Ambassador. And we have to stand And we should do more, frankly, to stand yeah. up. Uh, against 